today. It's uh, on Wednesday. Alyssa ran fever last night. About 100.5, 100.7, something like that. Um, she just wasn't feeling good. She was hot chills and anyway so this morning she still wasn't feeling real good her fever has gone but now she's got a tummy ache and she doesn't feel like eating or drinking she just feels really bad so we're going to take her to the doctor and let them look at her and see how what they think is going on her tummy's bothering her too so you can see she's not just extremely sick but she don't feel real good so we're going to go get her checked out Well, we're in the doctor's office, guys, and they have tested her. They're testing her for strep throat. She is running a fever again. It was 100.7. Um, so maybe we'll figure out what's going on, baby girl. How's your stomach feeling? Still hurting? Yeah, still feeling bad with her stomach. So if she has strep, maybe we'll get some antibiotics and get that taken care of. All right, what you think, baby? She just don't want them to break her finger, do you? So we'll let you guys know when we find out. Well, all right, guys, we are out of the doctor's office and they are treating Alyssa for strep throat. So she probably caught it at the babysitters. I'm not sure, but I do think a few of the babies or a couple of the babies or somebody had strep. Anyway, she's caught a bug. So we're but getting her- But not COVID. But not COVID, that's right. We're getting her some antibiotics. Um, and they didn't prick her finger. They didn't prick her finger. <laughs> no pen aid I do wish that it gave her a shot. Mm -hmm. It would have helped her get better faster. But that's okay. Them to give me a shot. I could have, huh? That wouldn't have been no fun, though, would it? So she's getting bubblegum flavored amoxicillin. <laughs> We're gonna get Lisa Joe some mashed potatoes at KFC. Maybe that will help her throat not hurt when she eats that. Bless her heart. <coughs> We're home. Alyssa's got some gravy here she's eating on. Got some mashed potatoes over here. I got some corn and a couple of chicken tenders. I got eggs and a couple of chicken tenders. How was the potatoes? They didn't make your belly hurt? Good. So now that she's had something like that, in a minute she might have to have some ice cream or something sweet, maybe. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, this is what they give her. I think every child in America probably every human alive has had a moxicillin. Yeah, <clears throat> see if this is a face, guys. What does it taste like? Nasty bubblegum. <laughs> Nasty bubblegum. <laughs> I'll just set it right down in here. There we go. And let's get it over to the side. Yeah, there's his food. I changed this little food thing. He was. Uh, we had this, but that's going to be better, I think. It's bigger. We can get in there. <coughs> okay, let's just kind of give him a little bit of food. <clears throat> that's enough. Good job. She put him over there in the food, so maybe he'll know we give him fresh food. He don't come out a whole lot during the day. He likes to come out at night, don't he? Mm -hmm. 
-hmm. I think he's nocturnal. What does nocturnal mean? Sleep all day. Sleep all day. I mean, eh. Sleep all day and sleep. I mean, eh. Stay awake. Stay awake. All night. All night. And then I think our cat's that way day. too. Don't you think our cat's that way too? Yeah, yeah the cat's I, that way too. I know that's the way. Yeah. Because <laughs> he likes to meow all night, don't he? Shields moving. Her shields moving. First time on the camera. No, we've had it on here before. Uh, hey, Patrick. Does it hurt when she pinches you? I don't know. Can you look at it? I don't think it hurts bad. Alyssa's, Alyssa's going to try to give him a carrot. I don't know if he'll eat carrots. It says on the internet that they might like carrots. Ooh, he come out for that. Look. He says I might have to check it out. Lay it in there, see what he does with it. Mm -hmm. I didn't know what I just scared it. This is normally what we, well, this is what we're feeding Patrick. Hermit crab variety diet helps support healthy growth and exoskeleton formation. We just get this at PetSmart. It's $10 a bottle, though, so it's pretty expensive. But this is all we've been feeding him. Um, we did just give him a carrot. I don't know if he'll eat that or not. It may be something I have to take out of the cage later, but we're just letting him experiment with that. We've had him for two years. We got him hey. at the beach in Orange Beach two years ago. Yeah. And um, he likes the little Hello Kitty shell, so it may be a little girl crab. We don't know. And, um... We might have to get him a friend. Well, I don't know about the friend thing because then we just have to take care of two. So we'll have to see. My kids love animals. Here is Patrick on his little stick. We went and got him a stick. So he has his food, his water, and his little stick in all of his shells. Uh-huh. Yep. And I think he likes this, uh, cutie one. This Hello, kitty. Yeah. yeah. Guys, he likes the stick. He's climbing up it. You think it'll be playing because it's cute. He's at the top of the stick. Do -do 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 -do. And he did it. Patrick, you're going to fall. Tell me if If y'all like this song. Can't record very long. We'll get copyrighted. <laughs> but they're out here playing music in the garage. Making Alyssa feel all better. Brought her machine out here and got it going 90 to nothing, don't you? You like that music? All right, I'm going to turn it off so y'all can uh, play your music. Everybody knows if you have strep throat, you need popsicles, right? Best thing ever. You don't have it recording. I do too. And of course everyone knows that Alyssa's favorite things are always blue. From blue ice cream, yeah. to blue snow cones, to blue popsicles. We're going to change the baby's cage. The, yeah, the bird's cage. The bird's cage. These little dudes. It's very messy down there. Three birds can make a big mess. Just say. Can't you? Can't you guys? You guys can make a big mess, can't you? Yes, you can. Don't shake your head no at me. I see it. I see a big mess. Yes, I do. For me, 
Okay, we just got our garbage can right here, and we'll help Alyssa pull this out of the cage. Okay, pull it on out. Let go for a minute. I'm going to get that hand down in there. Now, take the paper. Hold it down there. Let me get in the cage now and get this out of the bottom. I know how to make a mess down here. Guys, I'll leave this up until we get this back in there. Here you go, let's uh, push it in there. There you go. And then I just lay this down in here to make sure it's level and I take it pop and push it in like that. Well guys that's all we have for today. Maybe Alyssa will be feeling better tomorrow. We'll try to let you guys know. Hope you enjoyed our video. Please like and subscribe. And give us a big thumbs up. Bye. We'll see you in our next video.